I want to own the best weapons and armor in old school RuneScape, but there's a problem. Some of these items are pretty expensive. I have reached the stage in my account where I can do most if not all of the best money making methods. No staking, no donations, I am going to become a PVM god. My name is Ingus, and welcome to RuneScape Dream Gear. Now, before we begin, there are four stages that you guys should know about. The focus of this video is to progress to stage one, meaning I will need to obtain a bank value of 500 million GP. I'll be starting this series with a bank size of 350 mil. However, included in that is all of my untradeables. So I would actually estimate my true bank size to be closer to 300 mil. To progress all the way to stage 1, I'll be hunting down RuneScape's most profitable bosses, starting with the Chambers of Zarek. Good luck! <gasps> oh! Ho -ho! Yeah, yeah! Uh, yeah, it's. Help, 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 help. I'm trying, bro. It wasn't worth it. Hey, I got <laughs> the an elite. Fight Dude, I'm at 98 kill count. Good luck. Zero deaths. Zero deaths. That's right. Oh, yes! No fucking way, dude. How happy are you right now? Well, so do you have pizza bagels? No. In your. We don't have diabetes land? in the United Kingdom. It's lame. Pizza bagels, we probably do, man. but I don't buy them. You should. You're missing out. I got another torn prayer scroll. Oh, me too. Come on, Timmy. Dude, no fucking way, man. Oh, dude, I got fucking work. I got destroyed right there. Garbage. Dude, hell yeah. <laughs> God damn it. So for this next clip, Gomo was sharing his screen on Discord and I recorded it because he got a purple. This is a big occasion because Goma is exceptionally dry at raids. Oh, it's so it's beautiful. It, it's definitely the Dinny B. Don't say that! I'm, the only thing that can cause a reflection that purple is a Dinny B. <laughs> oh fucking hell. I had to leave after that one, but Goman will so continue to do a back to back as tradition calls for. Because he's an Iron Man, obviously he gets to keep whatever purples he gets, while Goma and I will split our drops if we're in the same raid together or if we're duoing with Wilso, then we will just free for all it basically. And guess what? We also got an ancestral robe top the next raid. So of course now they have to go for the back to back to back. And we also got another pair of claws, and Goma still just has that arcane. <laughs> so after they got the back to back to back, I was able to come back and join the next raid. And this is what Goma got. <laughs> Tecton the bus. <laughs> I'm gonna die again because you fucked me, dude. <laughs> Tecton the bus. Alright. Oh, it's white. As you might have saw with my Twisted League clue scroll look, I went ahead and did this master clue in my bank, and I'm hoping that some of that luck transfers into the main game. Oh my god! I've earned myself 21,750 League points, and now we're going to spend them all. I'm gonna be buying every single reward because I just wanna keep them for myself. Like, can you imagine that this right here is my good old home in the woods. Now that I was back to the main game for good, it was time to liquidate some of the items in my bank. I was about to make a big purchase, the Dragon Hunter Crossbow. With the Dragon Hunter Crossbow, I could easily make back my money at Vorkath, while it's also still semi-useful at raids. With Vorkath being a steady 3 to 4 mil an hour, we'll be able to rebuild rapidly. 
Now, I'm still getting back into the groove of things because I have not done this in ages. As you can see, my starting kill count is 267, and I have no idea where I'm gonna end up by the end of this series. There we go. Basically, I'll be doing Vorkath while my friends are not online, but when they do come online, you bet I'm gonna go test this Dragon Hunter crossbow out at raids. That's a bomb. Bombasita, hide the chat. It's a white. Oh, I put it on clan shit. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, you got stacked up. Wow. Oh yeah, 96 K. I am definitely starting to get better at Vorkath, but this kill is a little clutch, I must admit. You see boys, it is all about getting that full inventory. That's how you make money at Vorkath. Oh, oh, <laughs> I just started looting. I didn't even see I got a dragon bow necklace. Wow, I wish that was worth something, but damn, that's a rare drop. Not looking. Wait. Wait, damn it. Nope. All right, we got an elite casket. Let's open it. We got a master casket, that, or a master clue, that's very good. And we got a master casket yet again. Not in Twisted League, I'm hoping the League will transfer some luck over to the main game, so let's just open this bad boy. Nope, uh, just some, just some toe flax. Welcome back to another day at Vorkath. We just hit 375 kills. We're still going strong. I, I can see why people would get bored of this, but at the moment, I am loving what we're doing today. It's a good one. Probably because you did every shortcut possible. Got white. I got nothing. You know, I might be a little upset if you get a purple wolf, so I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> then you have no right to be upset. Bro, not you got two rares. You got two rares. I've only gotten one in the last like 40 kills. You weren't there to experience them. I was there for one. Oh! <gasps> What is it? What is it? What is it? What is Screen it? Screen sharing, is boys. It? I jumped out of my oh. seat. Let's line up. <laughs> Let's line fucking line, line, up. line up. I literally jumped out of my seat. <laughs> 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 Holy shit. Okay. All right. All I'm right. so well, glad before, I was recording that before shit. Before you open it, I'm going to I'm gonna put my guess in the chat. I think it's pretty fair. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Good luck. Oh, is that a dex? Yeah! Is it okay? Oh. oh. <laughs> Turn that shit <laughs> off. This is so perfect. Goma gets the arcanes, I get the dexes. While we wait for this dex to sell, we're gonna go for the back to back. Good luck. Wait. 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 Silver ore again. That's some good crafting. Okay. XP. Yeah. This is gonna be the surprise of the centuries. Die, you big. Too much to ask. 120kc though. Oh, I can't dodge that. Yeah, um... This is why you don't try to change the YouTube video while you're while you're killing Vorkath. You just do that out of nowhere. So with some of the money I've made from raids in Vorkath, I decided to buy a Dragonfire Ward. Really just for Vorkath, it's a little bit better than the Anti-Dragon Shield. There's not really any other use for it besides Vorkath, but... Since I'm doing Vorkath, I may as well just have it, you know? Just hovering above 418 kill count. And I thought I would show you this double plate skirt drop because I thought it was cool. So somehow I just never got the memo that you could add your head to the cape. I'm sure I could find a use for it somewhere. Wow, dude, another Dragon Ball necklace. You gotta be trolling me. I finally remembered that I had an elite clue in my bank. Absolute trash. Ah, this one's not bad. I got a master clue at least. Let's open it. Ooh. Asuna Vier Mascara de Demonio. There we go, everybody. 500 Vorkath kills. Going strong. Hard. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm taking your aid. You are not worthy. Dude, my health was 19 when I died. My well, health was 19. All I know is I just pilfed your aid because you are not worthy. You fucker. <laughs> Everyone special. It's a white. Show me the ranger boots. If I'm not mistaken, this should be K 
kill number 600. So one of my friends told me that they were planning to nerf Zalcano. So I went ahead and bought enough gold ore to get me the elite Lumbridge diary requirement, since it's only 175 each. Worst comes to worst, I can just merge it for more later. So I found this guy that says he's doing a drop party, and I highly doubt that he recognizes that I'm following him, so we're gonna see where this leads to. So I'm not sure if this is a lure, but I mean, if it is, it'll be kind of funny. I mean, if this goes on for longer than an hour, then I'm probably just going to dip. <laughs> At least I wasn't the only one that got bamboozled. Like I said, I wasn't really expecting much, but you know, what can you do? You never know with these things. You never know. All right. Well, we're back to the elite casket. What do we get here? So at first glance, this doesn't seem like it has anything to do with making money, but hear me out. I'm going to be using this gold ore to get the Lumbridge Elite Diary done. Overall, this will just make Slayer a little bit more convenient and uh, shouldn't take too long to bust out. With the money I made from Raids and Vorkath, it was time to trade in some of my items for the next upgrade for our journey the Dragon Hunter Lance. This weapon is gonna be incredible for raids because it gives a 20% accuracy and damage boost when fighting any draconic creatures. It also has a crush attack style for Tecton and a stab attack style for Vasa. And when I finally get back to Slayer, this will help me kill rune dragons quicker, opening up a new avenue for making money. King <laughs> Bro, you guys, you told me to sell the hammer, man. You're the yeah, because we know you can't do it. The now hammer the had crab. nothing to do with that one. The Just what you stood in the corner. How about Hit this? The crab. Hit the crab. Oh, oh it's a tick too late. I told you also, like, I don't know why you trusted us in here. Jesus, uh, you two are fucking special in this room. I'm getting out of here. I'm just gonna watch. Dude, I've been watching Goma. He's been, he hasn't been deflecting that shit to me. I've, why have you got fucking eight? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why are you doing it that way? Bouncing it all the way around the room? Where well, you can just stand... Oh my god. <laughs> We're playing Goma, come hoops. Stand here. Come stand here, Goma, where I'm stood. We're playing hoops. The Look. rest of the day... It's Why? Quite. Now it's ranged. Give me the hot Ruby. dog, baby. Oh my god, I got a purple! Nah. Dude, do you hear what I just called? No. You hear? You heard what I just called, right? What you said, Dinny B? No, no, I did not call that. I did not call that, dude. Dinny B, wasn't it? Oh! Come on! Oh! That's not bad. That's like <laughs> ten mil. Or how much is it? It's thirteen. That's not oh. bad. I'll take now it. log out so Goma doesn't get any of it. <laughs> All right, now you've got to wait for the next raid for the back to back, and then go Fuck. sell it. Yeah, you're right. You, you okay with that, Goma? Yeah, let's do it. Let's trade do it. screen on. Good support. Yeah, trade screen guy. It's white. Yeah. White. I'm going to get a twisted butler. White. 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 Full send, though. That would have been a send. world record send. White. Nine. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Give it out, boys. <laughs> Take her down. We are lighting. Oh my <laughs> God. <laughs> I see a 52 as well. Oh, oh, oh. Dear. Oh, and he goes down. The Darak warrior. Oh, rest in peace. Hit. Oh, fucking 54. 68. 68 in Darak. Oh, I'm sending him. Go, my dear oh trash. Oh my God. <laughs> Good luck. Why? After those shenanigans, I attempted to do a solo. Well, here goes nothing. As you might be able to tell by the points, it didn't go so well.
Don't worry though. I'll keep practicing. Oh, I do it. I got a white on 12k points. Trade screen, and it's white. All right, elite clue is done. What's the reward? Nani? It's a white. So I'm finally able to do this rune dragon task since I got this lance. And let me tell you, I am shredding these things. We got another elite casket. What do you think it's gonna be? 50k, 100k? Maybe 150k. I don't know, but let's let's open it, boys. I should have said higher. I really should. <laughs> I really should have said higher. Uh, I mean, it's better than the last one. So, all right. So I kind of lucked out. My next task is actually demonic gorillas, and I haven't done these in a very long time. The drop rate for a Zenite shard is one in three hundred, and it is currently worth fourteen mil. So. That would be pretty sweet if we get lucky. White. Yeah, I got a white too. Like me. That is white. a white. It's a white Christmas. For a purple. White. It's a white. 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 Good, luck. Good luck. This loot right here is absolutely stunning. I should start doing mining so I can outpace Goma. <laughs> it's a white. Since Goma's been so dry at raids, we thought maybe his luck is hiding somewhere else. Like the Ceridoman God Wars dungeon. Oh, dude, the feast does not stop. This is a trade screen on kill right here. Is it? It's a fucking Ceridoman. Dude, kill. trade screen on. Oh, it's just ran our weeds. Genuinely believe that my account is cursed. No. Oh, no. I guarantee it's going to be back to back drop. Don't, I know what it is. Stop, it's garbage. <laughs> you just got a pet, boy. You better keep that sword for eternity. <laughs> Dude, I'm afraid to go to Bando, so we're gonna get Bando's boots. Well, I shouldn't say we, I, I should say that you're probably gonna get Bando's boots when we go, dude. I, I actually think I am cursed. That, bro, was the worst experience I've ever had in the game. Two and a half mil. Minus that inventory of prayer potions that we had. And it looks like we made 500k. So, we're at Bandos once again. Actually, this is the first time we've been to Bandos in a long time. And he's down. Oh my god, no! I'm done! I'm done! I'm done! I am done! <laughs> I Give me the hot dog armor. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go scream in my pillow one sec. I'm gonna. <laughs> Just when you thought the luck couldn't get better, the shield left half comes in at a one in four thousand two hundred drop rate. We can make it. Oh. <laughs> if I get an arcane, I'm going to stick my bow. All right, elite clue time. Time to open. What do you have to say, Mr. Zol Ogersh? Good talk. Yeah, um. <gasps> no fucking way. Purple! Purple! Well, so when you were gone, I was like, I'm oh no, dude, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's a T-bow. It's a T-bow. <sighs> get a get over here. Get over here. We got to do the walk. Get over here. I, I knew it. I had the purple lightsaber out. It was, it, it was destined. Everyone, you just have to picture uh, the T-bow. Picture the T-bow in your mind and it'll happen. I'm not even going to look. I'm not even going to look. I'm closing my eyes. Uh, well, I'll fucking scream what it is. <laughs> it's good that Goma didn't get this, because if he got this, he said he's gonna stake a t his Tebow if he gets an arcane. Unless it's good a Tebow. White. Yeah. Damn it. Boo. Good luck. Good luck. White. White. Boo. I only can't tell when it's fucking white. Good luck. 
Why? I'm ready to flick on redemption as soon as I hear it. No! Ah, <laughs> oh, God, no. There we go. Hey guys, so as you can see, the series is over. I have a bank value of 1.5 bill. We're good, we're done, let's get out of here. I'm just kidding. Goma let me borrow his bow, so uh, I just have it for the time being. I think he's feeling a little discouraged. But uh, I wanna test it out at Zolra, see if we can get anything. Yeah, nothing. So I brought the bow to Sarah because it would be very nice if I can get a cheeky Ceridome and hilt. You know, this thing hits so hard on Zilliana, like if I had a bow of my own, I would be camping here all day. Well, I think I'm gonna have to give back the bow soon, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop at 100 KC. You can't always expect a drop. So I'm actually back at these demonic gorillas because I wanna see if this twisted bow is good here. Okay guys, I can already tell you right now that this, the twisted bow at demonic gorillas is absolutely insane. Dude, I am literally just shredding through these, if you can see all the stuff in my inventory. So, I had to give the T-Bow back to my friend. Alright, Bandos with the boys has commenced. Here they come. We got G-Rider. We got Goro Majima. And Earthling coming in hot. We've been trying to do more bossing from time to time, especially since I'm doing this series. So, definitely join my CC. I got a lot of stuff planned. And we got a God Sword Shard 1. If he would stop pulling us. There we go. Why? All right, so it is now time to sell my loot tab because I have done quite a bit of work cat. Okay, so overall that gave us 10.6 mil just in my loot tab, just from doing Vorkath and uh, a few raids here and there. And I'm gonna add this to my current cash stack, giving us a total stack of 32 mil. And what I'm gonna do with this 32 mil is buy an Abyssal Bludgeon. Now you're probably wondering why did I buy this Bludgeon? Well, at the Demonic Gorillas, I absolutely hate having to switch between Arc Light and a Blowpipe. It's just really annoying. It's just an extra switch. And Bludgeon is actually fairly decent at the Demonic Gorillas. It's not as good as the Arc Light, of course, but considering it doesn't use any charges, uh, it's a good option and there's one less switch. So I'm gonna probably bring that to Demonic Gorillas. <laughs> no. Good luck, good luck, good luck, Tebow in my name. No, dude, it's gonna be that fucking Dex for going on. That fucking song. I think this island says everything. <laughs> good luck. Yeah, good luck. Why? All right, this will be the last load of gold ore for a long freaking time. Look at this. Boom! 86 smithing. We're finally done because this is the last requirement for the Lumbridge Elite Diaries. Awesome. Elite task is done. Here it is. The Elite Lumbridge Ring. No Draymond staff in my equipment or inventory. Ah, uh, you know how long I've dreamed about using the Fairy Ring without these Draymond staffs? Trade screen on. Oh! It was a little delayed, but that's what I was saying when my mic was muted. But we didn't get any uh, Xenite shards from this whole task, so I guess there's always next time. So let's sell all of this and see how much we get. The Celastra seeds have not sold yet, but we still have 4.5 mil without them. So that's not too bad. It'd be a lot nicer if we had a drop or two, but you can't be expecting that. So the Nightmare Boss was just released, and I'm sure you've seen a bunch of videos on it. I think I did about 20 kills or so, but the thing is I had bought that bludgeon before the boss came out for like 27 mil. And since the bludgeon is one of the best items to use on the nightmare boss, uh, it went up to 40 mil. So I sold that bad boy for a nice 12 mil profit. <laughs> no, Good luck. Oh Bye. my God. Oh, he's got purple. He's got purple. Oh fuck! Oh, it's been so long. Uh, Go on. Oh okay, dear. Are we ready? Did he, did he be? Did he be? Are we ready? Okay. Three. Goblin saluting back here. Goblin saluting. Thomas.
I'm gonna keep goblins until, until you open it. So goblins will be low. Oh, oh, that could have been a Tebow. That could have really? honestly been a Tebow, but I will fucking take it. How much is that worth? 77. All right, you guys, the Kodai insignia has sold for 76 million GP. I now have a 90 mil cash deck. <laughs> and would you look at this? We finally did it. We have amassed a total bank value of 500 million GP. Looks like we're off to a great start.